team, it's been a while. Welcome back to another episode of the Shop Chronicles! <laughs> Me and Stiggy have news. We've been absent because we didn't want to litter you with videos of just day-to-day -day life. But we've got a second shop and we're on our way there now. So um, we thought we'd bring back the Chronicles because one, a lot of you have asked why we stopped doing them. So noted, we will start again. But you all seem to find the journey um, from us acquiring it because we've always been quite transparent of how we find the shop to how we do it up to then how we turn it into the smithons that you know so yeah we thought we'd take you do the big reveal um we're heading there now It's important to note though, me and Stig will still be in the Solihull shop. So we're not gonna suddenly run off and start opening other shops and you'll never see us again. The whole point of this business was to be part of the community and the other communities that we go into. We want you guys to know who we are. That's why we stick our faces in front of this camera, despite neither of us feeling that comfortable with it. But we want you to know that we're committed to the same sentiment, the same community message that got us this far. So thank you, thank you, thank you for all of you that have become the loyal customer base that Smithens has got because it's allowed us the ability to find a second location. And I'm um, excited to share the journey with you all. the thousands in attendance and the millions watching around the world ladies and gentlemen uh... Barton Green, here we come. We've already started the clear out so you saw the images before as we walked in and this is where we are after a couple of hours beautiful pink door we've got everything off the walls that we can so far if anyone wants a cheeky little rinse though they can pop over in the next couple of days and we'll get it done for them before these get ripped out little kitchen and then the stig and his dad have made us some bespoke units. Look at these bad boys. 
So this will be the general look and feel of the shop. So for those of you that have shot with us before, it will be the colour scheme that you've seen. It will be the kind of reclaimed wood units. Um, we're going to put all the bakery and counter stuff here. And the general premise of this shop is the same as Prospect Lane. Obviously it's smaller. For those of you that have been to the Prospect Lane store, you can see there's a vast difference in size, but we're gonna stick to um, the stuff that you know is best for. Cakes, fresh bread, patisseries, takeaway coffee, takeaway sandwiches, fruit, vegetables, nice deli counter, locally sourced cheeses. Um, and we're gonna stick with kind of those staple items and then add as we go. Um, but we will still do things like the afternoon teas and the hampers that a load of you are supporting us with at Christmas. But we'll draw some of the stock down from Prospect Lion because that's the beauty of, of having a second shop. So that's where we are today and we'll keep you updated as we go day by day through the build and we'll see where we finish up tonight. Yeah. End of day one at Bark Green, me and Stig off back to Prospect Lane because where we are we don't actually have a skip access so me and Stig are now going to go drive back to Solio and empty the van and fill up the skip back we're back in that sacred prospect line and look what main sticky you've got to do now van full load this bad boy Everybody remember Bertha? She's still here. She goes next week. What exciting news. Two shops and Bertha's going. Oh, what a time to be alive. But yeah, that's the end of day one of Barn Green. You know, you know the location. Um, and it, we reckon, we reckon it's going to take us the best part of four weeks to get it open. So hopefully by the beginning of April, We'll have uh, the second Smithton's open, but we'll keep you updated with the progress as we go. So, there it is, Barton Green. Massive, massive thanks to you all that have shared the post already going out. We're super, super, super buzzed about the new place. But as I said, when we were driving you down to Barton Green, doesn't mean it will be at the, uh, the cost of a uh, prospect line because we've obviously got me in the stig. Lindsay the manager, Daz the chef, Becky the assistant manager, you kind of got to know us all now. But um, none of it had been po possible without your help and support. So thank you very much. And as you've all asked for uh, some more updates on the, uh, the video situation, we'll stick one out a week. We'll kind of keep you up to date with the progress at Barnt Green. And um, we've got quite exciting announcement um, about a like, charity partner that we're supporting um, with food. But I'll leave that for uh, another video when not, they're ready for us to tell everyone. But again, that was off the back of all of your help with the kind of pay it with the post it. Um, we did some kind of digging around and I think we found a partner that should be like really well received by everybody. Um, they're awesome, so really, really happy that um, we're able to support them. But once it's all finalised, we'll stick it out there and um, I'm sure you'll all be keen to support because you, you have done from the beginning. So thanks as always, stay safe. We're getting ever closer to uh, the coffee shop, which has now become the office, being back open. But we'll see you in the next one. Take it easy, guys. Bye.